What's up guys, what is up, and welcome back to another video. Today we return in 7 Days to Die, and well, uh, someone told me that I got some juicy meat. And I know, I already know I got juicy meat, but not that type of meat, you strange sicko. Ooh, a fire! I didn't even know we had a fire here. Is that a cooking pot in there already? Ah, we got an extra cooking pot anyways. Let's go ahead, plop a cooking pot down, and put this raw meat, do something with this raw meat. We, I don't think we can do anything with this raw meat. Why can we not do anything with this raw meat? Why is there... Hello? Do I not know a recipe for raw meat? Can I not char it? Oh no, we gotta make the grill. We don't have the necessary stuff with the grill. Anyways, welcome back. Uh, I just want to, at the very least here, put this thing away into like some sort of container. Because that's what's attracting them to us. We smelled delicious, frankly. And uh, that's not good. I know, you always try to smell delicious in real life. You got the girls like, oh my god. You know, I, I, here's the, what do you think of my new perfume? And it's like, yeah, it's like, this is a new type of delicious. It's like, oh my God, I want to eat you delicious. And not that type of eat you, you fellows out there who catch my drift. <laughs> I'm a funny guy. Anyways, welcome back. So the verdict was we're going to go ahead and stay on 150 loot at least for a while. I might ask again after a certain amount of time and see what y'all think. But for now, we are going to stick with this and see what goes. And apparently, we accidentally turned it to zero loot because there's literally nothing in the boxes we've all searched so far. Like, there's actually absolutely no- Okay, no, never mind. Never mind. It's not broken yet. And uh, we got a little bit of time here until nighttime. Yo, hold up. Does that lead to the basement? No, it leads to a- Oh, loot. Look at that fancy toy. What is that? Do you guys see that? Is that a mirror? Oh, is that the mirror? Yo. No way, it's a working mirror. I mean, I never seen a mirror that has lag, but still, it's a somewhat working mirror. God damn. Welcome back, though, guys. Uh, we're catching some bottled murky water, just like we catch Pokemon. And, uh, well, yeah, we got a lot of organization to do. I got rid of the meat, though. We'll do something about that. We got a little bit of time left. I would love to go out and, like, do something with that time, but I'm just kind of... Actually, no. Yo, 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 yo. We got, we got options, so we're going to... Quick waypoint there, and then I think the pharmacy's right there. I'm gonna give it a cave waypoint. Never mind, no we're not. Alright, we're just gonna remember where this is. Make sure we get back here before shit really hits the fan. And we're gonna see if we can't get some goddamn antibiotics before we die a horrific death. We got the bank and stuff. We're not gonna be sticking in this biome. A lot of you guys were agreeing with my verdict that apparently this biome really sucks to survive in. So what we're gonna try to do is at least loot the juiciest things they have here. Mmm, I got the juice. And, uh, take things from there, really, but here we got the Papa Pills. Uh, the way I say it, it's like Papa Pills, like, you know, Papa, oh no, Pop and Pills. I was gonna say, like, Papa Pills, like, Pops, what you up to? I don't know, I'm just weird. Eh, you guys, you guys already know that. Anyways, let's, uh, get into through here. We got pill cases, and we're just looking for some goddamn medicine, dude. Come on, give me, give me strength. I just need antibiotics. How are there not antibiotics in a goddamn pharmacy? Don't tell me all the other survivors already took the antibiotics. Like, they're not, they're not that perfectionist, right? They can't take that many antibiotics. That is, that's a lot of antibiotics, okay? So, while I continue to stress out over this, hopefully we do not get destroyed here by zombies. Uh, two first aid schematics. I've never seen two schematics at once. I'm very scared. These noises are getting very loud. Oh, are we being surrounded? We might be starting to get surrounded. I don't know. It's also really dark here. Please, pills. How is pills that that are... No, 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 no. No, please, pills, pills. How much, how much time we got here? How much time we got? Okay, we still got a little bit of time. I'm still very anxious here. I'm picking up those. This is the worst pharmacy ever. What pharmacy does not have goddamn antibiotics? Actually, JK, I'm pretty sure you need antibiotics to be prescribed to you, but still. Alright? Who the hell? Let's get that logic out of here. I don't need logic. Logic's overrated. Alright? Well, not the rapper. Rapper's a pretty cool dude. But, like, the actual physical logic, even though it's not actually physical, overrated. Okay. Uh, continue reading up on that. It's just very scary just hearing so many noises. Like, I, I know that, like, they're, like, they're just so close, and I hate it. I hate it. I hear them. They're getting very close. Oh, there we go. There we go. Oh, drop something. Drop something. Okay, we're good. We got the antibiotics. Okay. Hyperventilation aside, we made it. What a beautiful sunset on such a shitty, shitty town. Oh, wait, weren't there like three bears throughout this town? Like, we should be a little bit careful that we don't run across one of those. Those things are pretty deadly, but... Deep breath, boys. 
We made it. And also, yeah, it did seem that the verdict was, uh, we're gonna stay with 150 loot, and also get the hell out of this town, because these things are really not built for survival, and they are not the best place to live. Like, really, they're not. They, they suck. Like, I'm not gonna lie, like, the, for what the property values are, it's really not a good deal. You're better off moving to Florida. Although, I'm pretty sure Florida would have a lot more zombies. Actually, you know, do you ever think about that? Like, the zombies in Florida, I feel like Florida would be pretty safe, because think about it. Florida's like all those old retired people, right? I mean, then you also have the beaches and like the young party animals and stuff, but imagine the disproportionate amount of old people. Like, I feel as if like old zombies, you know, they're, I don't know, they might have a walking cane or something. I've never seen a zombie with a walking cane. I mean, I've seen crawlers in this game, but I don't know, you know, I'm just, I'm, I'm just saying, I'm just saying. Oh, that's not, that's not good. Let's upgrade that. Where's this lead to? Are there like three? Oh, that's a balcony. Oh, nice. We got a little balcony. We could, you know, spend the night here. Oh, God, we're hunted. No, let's go back inside. I like inside better. <laughs> Inside's way better. Anyways, hope you guys are having yourselves a fan freaking test day. I'm doing good. Did some more classes. Um, I heard something like, uh, did, I think someone went on the spikes outside. See, that can be uh, pretty, pretty brutal. Anyways, um, I hear noises. I don't like hearing noises, man. There's literally a zombie right there. No, 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 zombie. That's not how this works. No, no, no. You go away. You go away, zombie. I'm just gonna... How much wood do I have? Alright, we can uh, repair this thing for a decent amount of time. You're... No, 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 no. You're not coming through here. I'm gonna make sure to repair that and that uh, you don't kill me. I don't have anything that they should be using to sense me. That's still pretty safe, I think. I haven't broken through the bottom, but the top is sketchy. So yeah, we're getting the hell out of here uh, come come morning. We're also going to make sure that this thing gets just kind of repaired every once in a while and hope that these zombies... How am I... How am I that sensed? Come on, how am I that sensed? I don't know. It's, it's dark, though. I'm going to stick by the candlelight. They're aggressively hitting that door. I, my air conditioner just scared the crap out of me because I was not ready for that, but it just went That's literally just gonna be a recurring thing now at this point. Like, that's gonna be a meme on the channel, right? My air conditioner. I never thought my AC could be a meme. Then again, I never thought a lot of things. I'm not a thinker. This is really not good. You have mul- like, I- Do you have any extra wood frames? I, I, I can't craft any more wood frames. Or at least I don't want to. Yeah, this sucks. Right, at the very least, let's make sure to scrap this. Um, you can attempt to go hide in the bathroom, right? I could tell some stories while I'm on the toilet. JK, it's like pitch black down here. Okay, we're gonna have to repair this a little bit. A lot of bit. How do they see me through there? Legitimately, how? It does not make sense to me. Like, there's only two of them. We might be able to survive this onslaught once they come. In the meantime, I'm going downstairs, I'm hiding on the pooper, and I'm hoping that these guys screw off. Because it appears that the zombies on PC, you know, they know I got the better graphics card. They're like, oh, if you can, if you can afford that graphics card, you know, you can afford a couple surviving more zombies. So, uh, we're just gonna, I, don't, I can't even see the toilet. We have a pew. Oh! Boys, the good news is if my, if I, if I shit myself, we're good. We're good. If I poop myself, oh, we're good. I'm literally like, I'm enjoying- You know what? This is a nice bathroom. If it wasn't a zombie apocalypse, you have like a beautiful view while you're shitting. Like, sure. Maybe you don't want to be watched while you're shitting. But still. It'd be pretty nice. And... Why am I sensed? Literally, why? There's no reason I should be sensed. Is it because I'm infected? Do they like, taste my infected blood? Fine. Bitch. Guess what? Not infected anymore. Sense this. Yeah, you're not. I don't, I, they're still continuing to sense me. Well... By the sounds of it, they screwed off from the upstairs, which is the good news. That was the main entryway that I was worried about. They're breaking in through the bathroom. I, I guess they heard how fancy our toilet was and they want a piece of that. And we're back upstairs. Let's repair the hell out of that. I think we're out of wood. No, we still have a little bit of wood, but we did repair that. We're gonna stick up here. Maybe we'll go to the balcony even. That is an extra door for them to have to break through. Although, 
They can also sense us if we're out there. We'll migrate there if need be now. The sucky thing is it's been like an hour so far at night, so we're really not doing the best, all things considered, but that's okay. Let's start being a little bit productive and, you know, doing some stuff. We got, oh, we got so many bandages. That's really good. All right, so pistol grip. We're going to scratch that. There's nothing super important here. Shotgun parts. Maybe should have kept that. Don't really care, though. Right now, it's all about inventory management, and I'm confident that we'll find more stuff. Like I was saying, though, before the zombies forced me to have a short uh, commentary on pooping myself. Hope you guys are having yourselves an awesome day. I, myself, am doing. I hate that they are so close. I'm doing good. You know, went to classes today. I hope I had to go to classes, but uh, yeah, signed up. Actually, I'm doing another class that I wasn't expecting that I'm going to be doing. That's like a huge computer science project this semester, so that's going to be, uh, you know, cross your fingers. Maybe it'll be like a cool mobile app. I don't know what it's going to be yet, but if it is, I'll totally link it to you guys for you to check out because, uh, you know, I need the most popular apps, right? And uh, these tokens I'm going to drop. I don't want those. I can equip the small stone. I didn't know that. Iron arrowheads will keep for iron arrows since we never really did that. Nails! We don't need nails. We still only have two arrows, a couple glass jars, water wise, and everything. Like, we're not doing good here. We're just gonna drink that water. We do need some hydration, then we're gonna eat some chili. I'm surprised we've yet to find any food either, so we're kind of struggling in a couple of departments here, but that's okay. Uh, if we want these blood bags, worse comes to worse. Vampirism! It's a good option, you know. It's like it's like I come knocking at your door, right? It's like the uh, what is it, Latter Day Saints? Like the Mormons? Are they are they the ones that come knocking to your door? I come knocking to your door, and I'm like, do you have a sec to talk about our Lord and Savior Jesus? It's like, do you have a sec to talk about our Lord and Savior uh, vampirism? And then as soon as you, you have to invite me through the door, because that's like vampire etiquette, right? I can't go through your doorway unless you invite me, because vampires have to be invited into a home. But once that happens, I go in. That's you accepting it. Bite your neck, and if you survive the whole vampire transformation, we're, we're in business. Okay, now is it just me? Or does nighttime go a lot slower on PC? I don't know if that, is that just me? I It does suck because, okay. Maybe we should go through some perks. Do we even have any perk points yet? No, we don't even have perk points, great. All the same perks though from, uh, yeah, they're all the same. Yeah, we don't even, we haven't even freaking leveled up. Uh, we could get to crafting, we probably want to craft something here or there. Uh, I don't know what we could craft. I mean, we could scrap those. That'll net us a little something something. Our inventory is a mess right now. I'm gonna get rid of these. Oh, I can scrap the band. Oh yeah, we get cloth for the bandages. Nice. Uh, I mean, we all we have freaking awesome bandages here, so we don't need any of that. Um, I kind of just want to get rid of the one small stone. I don't think that's super important there. I just kind of want to Make sure that we got a little bit of room. Uh, you guys seem to be enjoying the hell. Like, you guys were very supportive of the decision to move over to PC, so thank you guys for that. Uh, I, I really appreciate that. I was not expecting that to go over well. So thank you for being super chill about it. That's awesome. And uh, I did want to say that also since we're on PC, right, there's uh, more chances for collaborations and for playing with other peeps. And you know what that means. As a good old uh, professional 7 to die player known as Cage to the 8th, to the four, to the eight, and uh, there's a zombie literally at our door. I'm just gonna not move, not move. KJ for eight though. I'm probably gonna hop into him. I'm thinking once Alpha 15 drops, I might want to do a multiplayer series with him. Also Taco, Taco's really been wanting to do seven days with me, so maybe he could hop into and we could have a cool little series going. I'd be excited for that. You know, get the OG, get one of the OGs back in the seven days gang. And speaking of OGs, right? I wanted to ask you guys. I, I wish I could be productive right now. I, I, like, if you have a suggestion, if I'm ever stranded in a house late at night, you know, I'm talking, I'm talking in game. In real life, I'm not going to be stranded in what is a you know burning down trap house because it literally looks like you could deal crack out of here. Uh, I'm not going to be doing that in real life. But in game, you know, let me know what I should do if I'm ever in like another situation like this where it's not my base. Or anything like I know there's crafting, but let me know if there's anything else you might want me to do. And if not, uh, in the future, I will just edit these out. But there are a couple things I want to talk about first, so I'm gonna do that. And then if we still have some time left over, I might edit out the rest of this night because it is taken. It's dragging some ass. It's dragging some ass like a dog drags its ass on the carpet. Okay, sorry. <sighs> I mean, we already have our bed. Ooh, maybe put down our bedroll for the time being. 
No, I mean, unless we're about to die. I don't really think so. Bellows is going to be important. Uh, we could craft... Ooh, an Iron Reinforced Club is actually a good call. That's actually going to be really good for us. With way better than a wooden club. Still not the best. You know, our boops aren't going to be killing everything. But that'll still be solid. It's a... Ooh, level 7 crafting. Look at that. We are moving up in the world, boys and gals. And I don't think there's really anything else. Splints, bandages, we got those, we got those. Anyways, back on top. Oh! I think we have a bandana. I will craft a bandana. And then... Nothing else. Alright, well, back on topic. Hopefully... I wanted to ask you. I wanted to ask you, right? So, as you know, last year, I tried starting up the second channel, Star2K. Maybe you don't know, but I did. And that was a channel pretty much around, uh, well, NBA 2K16 videos. After one video, I didn't like where it was going, and I just never did anything with the channel. Now, I kind of want to go back to it for NBA 2K17, which is supposed to launch in like two weeks, give or take, right? And what I want to do is get your guys' opinion and also a quick heads up. Oh, hold up. I can craft a better roll. I should probably... Let's craft a better roll. We got to do that for our quest. We could do that. But I did want to get you guys as like... I think I'm going to do it. I'm going to have a different direction, though. If you guys know about 2K, I think I'm just going to be doing my team, which is like the online ultimate team type thing, where you like make your dream team out of NBA players, and you play like online, you do challenges, that type of stuff. Because that's my favorite game mode, don't ask me why. So I think I'm going to be pretty much dedicating the channel to that, to my team. And I'm going to be doing like pack unboxings and dropping stupid amounts of money on that, because... I'm not going to give a specific number because it would make me look like a gambling addict, but uh, I spent a lot of money on pack unboxings last year in 2K16, so just saying there's going to be a lot of pack unboxing. If you guys like just openings, like even like CSGO openings, any type of openings where it's like mad hype if you get something cool, I do plan on doing that, and I think it's going to... I think I'm going to take the channel in a cool direction. It's going to have... I'm not going to be doing like my career, I don't think. Some of you guys have no clue what I'm talking about right now, and that's cool. But that's pretty much like make your own player. I'm going to be like making my dream team starting from scratch, you know, doing game modes and stuff for like, like that. So uh, I'm going to leave a link in the description, hopefully, to Star2K. Go ahead and subscribe over there ahead of time. I uh, just want to give you a heads up now. It's an OG channel, right? It's like a year ago. It's pretty bare bones. There's one video. You could watch it and see what, you know, everything's about. But uh, if this sounds like something you might be interested in, if... Even if it doesn't, I suggest you at least check out the first video that'll probably come out in a couple weeks or so. So, like, subscribe now, and so I could just kind of gauge. And I'm really excited for that. Like, you don't understand how much I played that game, and I just didn't make videos on it. And I was like, hmm, it would've been really cool if I could've made videos on the stupid amount of time I spent on it. So, uh, I think that's gonna be the game plan here. So, I seriously, you know, go check it out. Go check it out. Uh, you can check out the current video. Am I gonna do anything with it, or is that gonna be? No, the current video is not going to be like the game mode I'm going to be doing. I need some eight. I need eight small stoves to make this campfire. Uh, but the current game mode is going to be nothing like what I'm going to be doing. I'm going to be doing my team, and uh, I don't know. I'm excited. I am. I don't. I don't know what else to say. I'm just. Uh, it's like it's three weeks till it launches or so. So it's still a while. But I did just want to get an early heads up. Give some guys a heads up if you're new or if you subscribed like a year ago and then I never did anything with that channel. But I think I'm going to do stuff with it now just because. I love NBA 2K, so we'll see how it goes. Am I the best player? No, but I'll, I'll, I have fun with it. You know, I do. Anyways, that's enough preaching about that. So I'm, I'm done there. There's my little sales pitch, right? It's like, oh, ho, ho, star, you play basketball. Yeah, I do. I love basketball. I'm sorry. Sorry that I love basketball in real life, and thus I love a basketball video game. I had to preach a little bit. All right, that's my that's my Mormon moment. <laughs> I don't know why that sounds like something they say it during like a game, like during like a TV game. If you guys watch sports games, you know how there's like uh, the the all state like instant replay where like they show a sick play, right? It's like the Mormon moment, and that was, that was right, right there. That replay is my Mormon moment of you know preaching to you guys to go check out my second channel. But I think I'm gonna be doing cool things with the second channel. So uh, real talk, I mean just just check it out, and then in a couple weeks when I do post my first 2K17 video. Let me know what you think. Maybe you'll like it. Like, maybe you'll never know, and you'll be like, huh, Star introduced me to something new. Or maybe you'll be like, huh, Star, you're a fucking twat. But I might already be that, or you should have already realized that by now. But, uh, yeah, yeah, that, yeah. Yeah, ooh, speaking of that, yo, let's break these tires, see if we get some, uh, I know we're hunted. I don't care. We got some spare tires out of that. Very nice. Awful quality. Ah, uh, you know, 
not even that awful quality wise. Yo, wait, there's something untouched there. Did you guys see that? Did you guys see that? Oh, oh, foul trash. That's what it was. Yeah, so we gotta escape. Ooh, hello, brass. Let's go ahead and do that. And then, which way do we adventure? Because we gotta find a better town than this shithole, right? We haven't adventured very far. Um, I say we head north. North, yes, we're going to head north. So we'll try to follow that road. Get the hell out of Dodge and take things from there. But hopefully we can settle down into a new town relatively soon. And, uh, you know, not let anything out that way. <laughs> settle into a new town relatively soon. And uh, don't break my legs. Nice. Settle down into a relatively new town soon. And I should begin some base building. Begin some fortifications and stuff. But in the meantime, do we have any beer? I gotta go run a marathon. So we can, do we have any alcoholic beverages here? Uh... Does the grain alcohol give us a buzz? Like, isn't grain alcohol pretty much, like, really strong vodka? No? Yes? I don't know. I'm 18. I don't know things about alcohol. I'm a kid. I don't know anything. I don't know why I'm using this voice either, but, oh my god, mister. I don't know shit. <laughs> I'm so weird. I really, is that a second? No, that's the same popping pills. I was about to be like, what? No way there's a second popping pills there. Mm. So I think there was one more tool store. It was the weapon store that we ran through, at least for a little bit. Hello, I hear you. No, we got the pill store, and I... Oh, no, it was a bookstore that there was. Got it. That's not going to be terribly useful for us, unfortunately. But this iron club... This iron club will be relatively useful. And there's the graveyard there. Would love to check that out, but I don't know if that's really the best fit for us right now. Right now, we got to migrate away from this... Oh, my God, look at that sun. Look at those PC graphics, man. PC Master Race, dude. Oh my god, that- Oh, what, a dog? No, 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 no. That's not how this works. That's not how any of this- Ow, 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 ow. I'm trying to draw my arrow. I didn't reload my arrow. I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die. Okay, wait. Jump on the sedan. Jump on the sedan. Eating. I'm just eating a bunch of blood kits. Oh my god, I'm a vampire already. Oh, uh, why is there a dog here? Oh my god, look at that thing. It's just fucking popping. It's popping wheelies, man. I've never seen a dog pop a wheelie. Oh, dude, we're so dead. We're not doing enough damage to it. Well. Oh. Okay, quick. Bandage, bandage, bandage. Oh. Oh. Okay, you know, good excuse to. Oh. We're leaving. I'm done with this shit. Done with it. Oh. Uh, I was not ready for a dog. Literally, I, I forgot dogs exist outside of, like, the city. Like, like, you guys don't understand. Back on the console game, in those, like, 50 episodes we did in that console season, right? Not once did I find a dog in the wild outside of the city or outside of a horde. That was unexpected as fuck. That scared the crap out of me. And literally almost killed me. We got... We got five, oh lo, 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 lo. I'm gonna I'm freaking doing the Age of Empires. I'm converting the dog or something. However the hell that works. Uh, I can make some more arrows, or I could YOLO it. Mm, I mean, I mean, let's get. I don't know. I'm just I'm scared now. I'm scared. That thing's gonna murk me. It's guarding the doorway. I wanted to take to. Okay. We need to leave this biome. We need to leave this biome. Oh god, it was looking in my direction. Thankfully, I don't think dogs have long sight. I think dogs are nearsighted creatures. So we might be good. You know what else sucked about that? We were doing like no damage to the damn thing. Because our freaking stamina was out. But, okay, the detour worked. Near death experience aside, we're having a good episode. I forgot the meat, but that's okay. It was only two meats, and I kind of forgot it on purpose. I mean, I would have forgotten it, but I accidentally forgot it. You know what I like? I didn't leave it behind. I forgot it behind, but I would have left it behind. You know, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Bird's nest too. Ooh, sweet mama feathers. God damn, there's some plump, plump, plump birds over here. Birds in the trap. Ooh, Suge McKnight. Let's go. Uh, I hear noises. I hear noises. For some reason, that car looked like it was following me. It might be because of like my field of view. Yeah, I have a pretty wide field of view too, if you guys don't know. Uh, I forget what the exact setting is. I think my field of view is on like 70 or something. I don't know. I think I I know it's I know it's wider than console. Cause like the first time I started playing, I'm like, yo, 
Why seven days to die looks so weird? Now I'm like, oh wait, that's why it actually looks not god awful like on console. I'm sorry, console's got some poopy graphics, man. Like seven days to die in general, it's not an aesthetically pleasing game except for the sun. Like those light, that light shit, it's magical. But like these trees, you know, they look like rigid little, rigid little structures. Nothing to write home about. Nothing to email, text message home about. It's more like just kind of, ah. Oh. Hey, mom. Today I played a, you know, game that had some rigid corners. I, dude, I don't know. <sighs> what is that? Big blob. Anyways, we got a little bit of running to do. We leveled up. We got five skill point. Wait. Why do we only get five skill points? On console, we got eight skill points per level up. That's weird. I, is that different? Maybe it's on difficulty? I don't... To my knowledge, I'm playing on the same... Di that's really weird. That is actually really, really weird. Okay. Hmm. We're going to outrun the crawler. And I mean, I want to go over here. Find something. I know we're probably not going to find another town today. Hopefully we find another town in day two though. Because that day seven horde. Day seven horde is not too bad. Oh no 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 no. I'm running away, I'm running ow. 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 Okay, let's uh apply this. There we go. I hate dogs. I hate dogs. I hate dogs. I hate this biome. Death's this biome. Death's this biome. No 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 rip rip rip. See, I... You have no clue how loud I wanted to scream there. Correction, how loud I want to scream. But I live... in a dorm now. I have neighbors. I like not being the most hated person. Fuck. You know... That's just unfortunate. See, if I had some be- Oh no, I- well... We're having a shitty start today. I'm not gonna keep going. I also have to ask you guys, in addition to your opinion on the 2K stuff, um, we might call in a tactical taco for the series. I gotta figure out how to get this world on a server. That's what I gotta do. Because right now, I'm not a fan of this whole dying to dogs. Dogs? Fuck dogs. I'm gonna say it. Fuck dogs. I hate them. In real life, they're awesome. But those guys, zombie dog, fuck zombie dogs. There we go, zombie dogs are assholes. Anyways, I was gonna ask you guys, um, what do we do from here? Because my shit's over there. I had a lot of medical supplies that I want to find. Probably gonna run after it. But if we die to that dog again, we might rage quit straight into multiplayer. Just saying, I've, I don't think I've ever done that. Like three to four parts and then rage quit into a new series, but. That might potentially happen because, I don't know, I kind of want to do multiplayer now because just dogs are shenanigans. I know I should, like someone's already furiously typing in the comments, oh you should add arrows, you should add arrows, like, I'm sorry, I wanted to find some place to actually settle down before I went ham on crafting, but I guess I learned my lesson, I'll oh, never, never do that again, but. Yeah, other than that, that's going to go ahead and do it for me. Thank you guys so much for watching the video, I highly do appreciate it, and uh, hopefully you have yourselves a... And for a fantastic day. You know, hopefully you're having one. And if not, hopefully this video either helped you have one or will help you have one. But uh, either way, I really do appreciate the support on the videos. Like, you guys have been doing pretty damn awesome with, like, likes and comments. And I love it. I love, you know, as you know from my 7 Days to Die series, I love sitting on the pooper and reading your comments. It's the best way. It's the best method of entertainment. Not gonna lie, but uh, graphic details aside... I might actually have to go to the bathroom soon, but those details aside, I highly do appreciate you guys watching. I do wish all of you a fan freaking fantastic day, and uh, yeah, it's going to do it for me. Hopefully more rage-inducing seven days to die, and uh, I wish I could have screamed so loudly because I would have. If I was at home, I may have broken my desk. That's literally the first time I've died in seven days to die, counting Alpha 14, counting the Xbox One series, which is, I don't like dying in games, man. I don't know, but... Screw it. I'm a scrub. What can I do? Anyways, it's going to do it for me. Thank you guys so much for watching, and hopefully I'll see you in the next one.